Bronson Watermarker lets you customize your watermarks. Let's take a look at how you do that. Here's the image that we started with. This is the 4th of July. Let's make it a little bit smaller so it's easier to work with. And let's turn off line burn for this demo. Let's choose triple so it prints three times. Now, if we click on the double A next to it, it pulls up the customization, letting us choose our fonts, maybe Gil Sands or Helvetica. Up above, you see the color selector. You can choose any color you want for the watermarker. Right now we're using the crayon picker, but the other pickers work as well. And sliding this lets you change the opacity, how dark it overprints the watermark on the image. You can be as subtle or as obnoxious as you want to be. When you're done, just save watermarked images. Let's save these to the desktop. And there you go. There's your image watermarked.